<laughs> Imagine that you made a product for which demand exceeded supply uh, for many years now and prices have been going up. But despite that, you continue to live in poverty. Uh, this is not a hypothetical situation. Uh, more than 300 million small farmers in India make food grains, fruits, and vegetables like these in very small farms of less than one hectare. They continue to be poor because of the small scale of their operations, because of various supply and production inefficiencies, and lack of public and private investment into the sector. Just one striking example. More than 40% of agricultural produce spoils between farm and consumer. I want to create a venture capital fund for these farmers. I want to tie up with nonprofits working in rural areas to organize these farmers into companies, invest equity so that they in turn can invest in lo needed local infrastructure, give them management advice to make them more profitable, and connect them directly to bulk commercial buyers so that they can get more of the value of this vegetable. My organization, Livelihoods Equity Connect, by demonstrating that these types of investments are possible, has the potential to mobilize large amounts of private capital into serving the equity needs of the poor.